come in. Please sit down. Okay, what is your name? Otto. Oh, and your last name? Kindberg. Uh, well, Mr. Coin, I mean, uh, Mr. Kernberg. Not Mr. Doctor. Doctor Kernberg. Uh, and what do you, what do you do? What do I do? Yes. What do you do? Are you serious? What do I do, Doctor Otto Kernberg? You never heard of Doctor Otto Kernberg? Doctor Kernberg. What do you do? I'm a psychic uh, analyst. Oh, World yes. famous. Yeah. Really? Of course. Of course. Okay. You know, and I write books. I speak. I, you know, I'm all over the place. And so, so what brings you here? This is, uh, you know, it's providential here, right? You're not going to talk to anybody about nothing. Very confidential. You, don't, you, don't, you, don't, you uh, don't need to worry. I look, it's pretty embarrassing. That's why. Yeah, it's embarrassing. Uh, look, uh, it's about stealing. Stealing? Yeah. You mean you want to stop stealing? No, I don't steal enough. Listen, lady. You want to steal more? Listen, uh, what, are you, what are you, a psychologist, a rabbi? What are you? Uh, well, it's like this. In, in 2012, I, I stole 645 bases. You know what I'm saying? 2011, I stole 787 bases in 200 bats. I stole second. I stole third. I stole in three and oh. I stole in two and one. I stole first base, I stole fourth base. You know what I'm talking about? I was a stealing demon. That's where I got my moniker. GTO. GTO? Grand Theft Auto. Uh -huh. But then, last May, I got the bad news. Nixon lost the elections. I got so depressed. I couldn't steal no more. My stealing days was over. I had to do something else. So I started this uh, anaclyptic practice. Mm -hmm. So, you know, excuse me. Yeah? What is it, BB? I told you to stop calling me, didn't I? Come on, what is it? What's up? I, st I spoke to Barack. I told him. I told him. He said he'd fix it. You know, just, just trust me. Will you on this? Just trust me and stop bothering me. Don't call me. Goodbye. Sorry for that. You know what? Let me just turn it off. Okay. So, uh, where were we? Oh, yeah. Lady, you're not helping me here. I, I, what? I'm here already, what, I'm here five minutes, ten minutes already? I don't, I don't feel like, I don't feel much uh, empathizing coming from you, from your end of things, you know what I'm saying? I don't feel like uh, you're, really, uh, you know, you're really connecting with me, you know what I'm talking about? So, <laughs> You need help, lady. I need help? Did you ever hear of Nefesh International? No. You never heard of Nefesh International? No. Nefesh International is a huge worldwide organization. It's the international network of uh, Greek Orthodox uh, psychoanalytic of uh, uh, mental health people there. They see patients, they see clients, they, I don't know what they say, they see all kinds of people. They, they have a convention once a year. December 26th this year, December 26th through the 29th in uh, New York, uh, Papaka, give it some place on the, on the island over there. I don't know how worldwide where it is over there. And then they eat sushi over there. And they eat, the, uh, they eat like kings at this place. And then they have a few uh, seminars or something. They talk to each other. I don't know what they do. Schmooze. You know, you should try it. You could learn how to treat delusional patients in that place. Lady, wake the network. 